All right, here we go. Here we go. All right, will it work? Hello everyone, welcome back and welcome to viewers to some more Stormworks. We are back at our harbor base and we're going to be doing some work on our big tank tanker thing. So let's not waste any more time. Let's go ahead and get started. Uh, real quick, I did sleep though. So we have radars researched and we should be good to go there. So let's, let's, uh, let's start building.
all right we are all done here uh i tried to do everything you guys suggested so hopefully i hopefully i've nailed those uh if i've missed your suggestion uh most likely it's because i forgot uh, i haven't seen any crappy suggestions yet so it's not that i'm trying to forget them i'm just they're getting forgotten i'm sorry uh just yell at me again in in, in comments if uh if i didn't do your idea because all the ideas are really great uh so starting here we've got an extra tank here that was suggested uh so we actually had to make the boat longer uh to accommodate that but we've got maybe 16, 17,000 liters that we can put there as well. So if, say, we're cleaning up oil and we want to do a fuel run or we just want to carry some extra diesel, uh, that's what we've got now. Uh, I think I need to get on the boat here so I can show you the rest of this here. Uh, obviously, I've added some bumper tires here. Oh, look at that ladder grab. That was amazing. Uh, automatic lighting here uh which is really nice i've got lighting up the top here uh so that lights up as well with the player sensors uh we've got a ladder to the roof now which is really cool so we can come all the way up here and get a better view around if we needed uh really nice uh i like that addition uh, also to repair things if we need uh coming inside here we'll just kind of go around backwards uh we've lost the window there because of the ladder which is okay uh got some more throttles here which control our ramp here you guys suggested to put some pistons on the front uh to more cushion the uh the blow when we run into things so i did that i've also i don't know if you guys can see uh i've also separated the ramp here into two segments uh so what we could do is actually fold the ramp in half uh and it just gives us a little bit more options uh of what we can do with that ramp uh as you can see there it is now folded in half so yeah that's, that's pretty cool uh i got a couple of extra seats here for our extra dogs that are hanging out and i've got tsunami legs now so if i can push this down now that that's down, we'll turn that on. Let me grab a seat, and you guys can actually see uh, there are legs that come down, and we'll grab the ground in the event of a tsunami. So, actually, I'm looking forward to sirens today. So, if we have a tsunami coming and we're on land, we're definitely going to test that out. Uh, so, let's bring that back up. Turn that off. Should be good there. Uh, other than that, I'm trying to think what else we did. Let me walk around here, and let me just see if there's anything else that I've changed. Uh, I do have automatic lighting on everything, which is really nice. Automatic lighting here, automatic lighting here. Come on down. Automatic lighting, really nice. Uh, here's a little covered area here for those tsunami legs. Uh, I've got one on each side there. We'll come up front. Uh, as you can see, we can still move around pretty much everything. Here is our regular fuel tank. We are nice and full. Uh, I've got to do some of these microcontrollers. They're a little just kind of loose and on the side here, and I'd, I'd hate if something happened to this one side everything we own all our systems would go down uh which would suck as you can see i've got some empty slots here these are connected to power so we can actually recharge stuff before we go to sleep you know so just kind of a nice little thing but that's hiding our tsunami legs there as well i just try to make it look a little nice uh let's see let's get back out of here uh it's really nice having all the automatic lights i don't have to worry about those they just kind of kick on uh i feel like i'm forgetting something i feel like i've done more than this but uh yeah so i think what we're gonna do let's take this we're already we're already ready to go here Let's take this over to the rest of the oil spill and let's clean that up and let's get this out of the world. Uh, I don't even care about the oil, honestly. I might just come back here and just despawn it just because we've got so much oil. We really do. And all we got to do is move to another oil rig and we've got more oil. So if we lose whatever this is, it's not really a big deal. But I just do want to test things out. Uh, we're a little crooked here. Let's see if I can go ahead and start up anyway. Uh, I am realizing I've got to change this screen now. Uh, the boat's a lot longer, and there's an extra little compartment here, so this literally doesn't match up, but that's fine. We'll, we'll work on that in the future. Uh, everything else should be good. Weather's hooked up now. Our radar is actually hooked up, so we can see what's going on around us, which is really nice if needed. So, yeah, let's go. Uh, let's see if I can get moving here. I'm moving. That is good. Can I get around this curve here? Come on. We're doing it. All right, we're away from the rocks. Nice. So the oil spill is almost 5k away, so let's just go ahead and head over there. Uh, let's clean that up, and then we'll see where we're going from there. All right, looks like I'm getting pretty close to the oil slick. Uh, I'm waiting for my, my thrusters to not work, and that'll kind of give us the idea of when we're in it or not. Uh, but that still says almost 2k away, but I can see it. It's right here. Okay, well, we're getting paid. We're getting paid for just being in the area. That's cool. Okay, uh, our jets have stopped working. We are. I feel like we're officially in, in the thick of it here. Uh, let's throttle up some more. Let's get some power to our engine. Uh, let's come over here and turn our centrifuge on. That's good and going. Let's get our pumps on. Come on, tanks. All right, and I need to double check here. I just want to make sure that we're actually getting oil. All right, we are getting oil. Perfect. Uh, let's go back up and uh, let's start driving around through it. really wish they would fix this. You get one little gulp of air into your system, and it's completely trashed. Uh, it's completely trashed right now. I am not sucking in any more oil because I've got one little gulp of air into our system. Uh, so that lets me know that, uh, one, I need to move where the 
fluid port is uh we'll move that further back i think uh we're, we're just bouncing over the waves and you can see it right there uh that is our fluid port so as soon as that came out of the water we were screwed uh let me see if i can turn around here and actually get out of this oil slick here now oh yeah we are struggling we are struggling yes come on just turn me around get me out of there okay oil's oil's been cleaned up cool we're making money doing it all right let me turn these off we'll get some more rps to our regular engine here all right, back in the workbench. Let's see if I can fix this real quick and get out there and we actually do this. Uh, so we're gonna grab this, we'll grab that, we'll slide it. Oh, I don't know, somewhere back here. We gotta worry about where our pipe goes too. So hang on, let's see if we can get our pipe moving first. We'll cover up the hole. Easy enough. Yeah, black, like the rest of it. We'll get in here, fix you. Now, we're just gonna have to run this pipe back and around the leg here. Okay, we can do that. Can I find it? There it is. I'm thinking we bring it all the way back to about here. That should be good. I don't think that part's coming out. Of, no, that part's not coming out of the water. If it does, then then it just does. Um, and I guess we could come further back here. Put some steps over that too. Okay, we'll do that. We'll do that. We'll come all the way back to here. Do this and we'll do that, 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 that. Is that how big it is? No, it's bigger this way. I think that's it. It might be one longer though. Uh, let me get the actual part here. Oh yeah, it is actually one longer. Okay, so we'll do that. Rotate that. Come on, let's fill this in. Perfect. Paint it. Fix it here. Get all that painted up. Perfect. There we go. All right, that's done. Um, now I need some stairs. Uh, I want to make sure we get over these without tripping. We'll just do like we did over there. Nice and neat. There we go. And we'll do the same thing here. Uh, so we can step over the pipe with ease. No trip hazards. There we go. Perfect. All right, that should solve the problem with that. Hopefully. All right, so let's get back over there. Let's see if we can clean this oil up. All right, we're off. So we're headed back to where we were. We're gonna see if this uh, this oil will actually be sucked up. And of course, the uh, the waves are nice and calm now um, so that we don't have any of that issue. But, you know, it's fixed. That was a problem we were gonna have no matter what we did. So it needed to be done. Uh, so let's get out there. Let's get the rest of the oil. Uh, let's get it despawned, get it back in, and then we'll go from there. All right, well, there's our glorious siren that we've been looking for, but uh, we're not on land to test it out. So I don't know what we're going to end up with here. Uh, we're just going to roll with it. Uh, I'm going to go out here and keep cleaning up this oil. If something hits us, something hits us. All right, the siren just stopped. I don't know if it's because we're so far away from the island and we're not near another one, but uh, we'll, I'm going to keep my uh, keep my eyes peeled here. All right, back on location for the oil. Uh, just by getting here, it cleaned it up again. Uh, let's go ahead and kick on our centrifuge. Let's see if we can get this working. All right, that's spinning. Let's get some oil in the tank here. Come on. All right, hopefully, hopefully this keeps working. Uh, let me make, double check, make sure that's not seawater again. All right, definitely still is oil. Definitely oil. And we're just kind of pushing through it. Another another two grand. Uh, I like the fact that we uh, we created a problem and we're getting like paid for it. Uh, I see a rogue wave. Uh, we do have a rogue wave coming here. It is very tiny. Um, I think that's what the siren was about here. Uh, it looks like we're about to clean up all of our mess here. All right, visually, I think that was it. I don't see any more oil here. Uh, let me check the map real quick. Uh, there is still some out here. Let's uh, let's head over towards where it is. Oh, and it's just now been cleared. All right, cool. That was it. Uh, we have cleaned up our entire mess. That is awesome. Uh, let's get over this little rogue wave here. Turn off this. Turn off that. How much do we get? Just a little bit. So we, we're not losing much by despawning it. That's that's fine. That's great. Oh, get over the rave. Get over the wave. Oh, oh, okay. It was enough that we jumped it. Interesting. All right, so I'm headed home. I want to test out one more thing here, and then we'll uh, we'll see where we go from there. Oh, okay. So there is the siren. We were actually just far enough away from the island that we couldn't hear the siren anymore. So uh, that's kind of interesting. Uh, should it be ending? Yes. Okay, it's over. All right, we've just now made it back home. It's gotten dark on us. I've got as many lights on as I can. So I can get one more light on there for you guys. You can see everything. There you go. But now I can't see, but you guys can see the boat at least. Uh, let's pull this into the workbench. We'll just despawn what we've got. All right, perfect. I need to save this because we did make a couple changes to it. Uh, the other thing I want to do here real quick is this area here was kind of dark. Uh, so let's, whoops, whoopsies, whoopsies. Let's not do that. Let's come in here and let's add another set of lights right here. We'll paint them our salty, dingy color and let's hook them up. And we'll hook those up right there. Perfect. Uh, where is the other one? just lost it there it is okay perfect so that should light up that area that area is a little dark since we've stretched it out um but that's all fixed now all right saving this okay so we are in creative mode here i, I wanted to test out the uh the tsunami legs so that's what we're actually going to do here um let me stop i'm gonna stop here uh let's lower the legs turn on the uh the magals all right looks like they have they have connected it sounds like it uh are we connected back yep we're connected back 
and we're connected front uh now all we gotta do is wait for a tsunami um hopefully there's one coming soon <gasps> there's one right there perfect i'm hoping these work uh i feel like they should uh worst case scenario is we have to add like two more maybe to the middle section of the of the boat here or maybe even four more i don't know uh but i feel like this should work hopefully it works uh my only concern is that we have too much buoyancy and it's gonna rip the magals off the ground but there's only one way to find out and that's to test it right all right here comes the wave it's definitely a big one uh we need to get ready for this oh the poor 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 horses or cows out there sucks to be them all right here we go here we go all right will it work oh 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 okay all right i'm digging it it's working we've got plenty of air in here look at that oh this is great this is so good okay thank you whoever suggested putting legs then magals on the bottom that worked great uh thank you for all your suggestions they all work great uh honestly keep them coming you guys uh so yeah that worked that worked perfectly so we've got some sort of protection on land for tsunamis so yeah guys keep those suggestions coming i appreciate them i really do i really like adding all your ideas to this boat and all my other creations so yeah if you guys are enjoying this series make sure you throw a like on this video subscribe to this channel if you haven't already and there will be more to come